Wolf Blitzer is going to prove yet again, like he does on a daily basis, that he is absolutely useless. Listen to Michelle Bachman get away with an egregious lie. That tells you the president had one idea for health care, which is the government ownership, government control, and government mandate. Right. We don't want forced programs. We want choice in programs and freedom for people. So this is the law right now, the Affordable Care Act. It is the law. Do you want to try to make it better? I didn't know the president had one plan for health care. Funny. Um, but to the serious point, water off a duck's ass. Water off a duck's ass, man. It didn't, he, he didn't skip a beat. He went right on to ask another ridiculous question, and he didn't challenge her at all. She just said, well, mm, yeah, the president, he had this one plan to do a government takeover of health care and government control and government, 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 government. Did I mention government? And Wolf Butcher's like, okay, now moving on, what do you think of uh, this, Michelle? Let me get your opinion as an expert and as a congresswoman who should be taken seriously. Look, l let me break this down for like the 12 trillionth time like we do on the show every day to people like uh, Wolf Blitzer who is an actual robot. He's battery powered. I don't know if you knew that. Uh, your job in the media, it's very simple. Get the facts out. So if that means in the middle of an interview you need to be rude as hell to get the facts out, by all means, rude away. Because that's your job. Your job is to get the information. Your job is to tell the American people, hey, this politician is bullshitting you, and what they're saying is 100% false. It is incorrect. It is not true. And here's why it's not true, and then you could lay it out. But Wolf, he didn't, even, he didn't think for a second. Well, maybe I should call her out and say that, you know what? What Obamacare is, is an individual mandate. Who originally proposed an individual mandate? Richard Nixon. He was the godfather of this type of health care reform. Then who codified it further later on? The Heritage Foundation. The Heritage Foundation is a right-wing think tank. In the 1990s, almost every Republican congressman, including Newt Gingrich, including Chuck Grassley, who proposed it, all those congressmen were for the individual mandate. They were essentially for an Obamacare system. And it's got nothing to do with government. Of course, what it does is... Uh, forces individuals to go to the private insurance market. Private insurance. It's got nothing to do with government. The only part of it that's government is the increased subsidies to the poor and the middle class. But the heart of the bill is to keep the private insurance companies intact. But Wolf Blitzer didn't think for a second, well, let me give her the information on this. That's factually incorrect, Michelle. He just let her gloss right over it.